is up everybody monster jeff fanatic here and as you saw by the video from walmart we found the new hot wheels monster truck die cast that comes with the free crushable cars now some of these have these crushable cars which i honestly would pay the four dollars just for these things this looks insane these crushable cars look so realistic definitely the most realistic crushable cars um i i've ever seen hot wheels do and then when you have others that have like these kind like actual hot wheels die cast i'm not going to show the casting but we're going to move a couple of these to the side we have seven to open we're not going to get into a much review on most of the die cast trucks because all of these are re-releases except two i'll save those two for last and that is the new roger dodger and twin mail they're recolors so we're gonna open uh v bomber first just to see um what the uh car is like since this is the first time we get a new crushable car like this it's not like the snappable ones that we've been getting since 2013 so let's take it out of the package we'll get a little look around of v bomber but mainly focus on this so we have the V8 Bomber casting. Of course, such an awesome truck. Probably my second favorite uh, Hot Wheels casting. So it comes in this little protective plastic thing. Here it is. It comes on a normal Hot Wheels base that um, all of them have. It says blindsided. So these are actual Hot Wheels castings. Just crushed. And they look really, really awesome. This looks like an older Dodge van. It does have wheels. It can spin. It's just the body is crushed. This is de definitely like the ideal crushable car that I feel like Hot Wheels should have used this whole time. It did take them quite quite a while to get it all right but i'm glad that um this is the finishing product i'm very proud it is quite heavy too it is at least this one is about the same if not a little heavier than normal hot wheels cars it is a matte finish obviously this one is red all of them are different colors so next we're going to take a look at the bone shaker this is the only uh, re-release truck that comes with a hot wheels car the other ones are the recolors so we have three of them that come with hot wheels cars like die cast cars then we have four that come with crushable cars as you can see there are seven in the whole case we got all seven here and we're gonna flip this around take bone shaker out of the package and take a look at the die cast so yes we have bone shaker there's literally nothing new to this uh truck um from when i last reviewed this so i'm not going to go into too much detail over that truck either but here is the casting this looks pretty awesome it has the hot wheels symbol on the side with the flames on the side and on the hood we have the skull just like on the real truck just shrunken down we have the v8 engine with the huge exhaust pipes we have black wheels with uh red trim and uh we have a red undercarriage so that is pretty awesome there is the matte black v8 bomber i love the skull on this side as well that looks awesome so now next up we'll do tiger shark um here's tiger shark basically the same um but look at the crushable car we have like a station wagon this actually looks like a real car but we'll see and we'll take this out of the package and take a look at it check that out there is tiger shark we basically have like the most popular like the popular oh i just dropped this car too doesn't matter it already looks crushed but yeah we have like most of the like the popular uh, hot wheels monster trucks but this is obviously what has my attention are these crushable cars almost looks like the hood comes up but it doesn't so we have it says flat iron so no this is also a hot wheels original so i guess these are hot wheels originals but they do look like real cars so i do like that i'm glad they don't look too fantasy um because these do look like real cars that have been crushed so this looks like a 90s station wagon so perfect car um it's an older disposable car that look it looks like one at least it still has that new uh die cast smell that all hot wheels uh die cast have it smells good in my opinion but um here is the station wagon tiger shark looks the exact same so if you guys are interested in any of these trucks just let me know um i will trade for you guys uh for anything spin master or hot wheels most truck related so next one will do the mega rex this one once again comes with a crushable car this one is yellow so we have the other two worst oh here's the van right here so those are the two we've gotten so far and then bone shaker car so let's take this out of the package and take a look at it this isn't the regular Mega Rex. This is the Mega Rex that came out like I, either the end of 2019, the beginning of this year. Here's the other one. Um, so nothing different whatsoever with this Mega Rex. And it's quite frankly probably the ugliest Mega Rex that they've came out with. So I don't know why they're coming out. They could have just came out with a regular one. That would have been fine with me. But let's take a look at the car here. This looks like an older, maybe like Chevy Impala Crown Victoria kind of thing. And look how crushed it looks even from the side. And it still rolls completely fine. Let's see. This is called Sudden Stop. So this is once again another Hot Wheels original. Original. and uh i do like the yellow yellow is probably like bakes like the coolest looking color for crushable cars in my opinion it does look really cool and realistic so we have these three crushable cars here so far those look awesome as you can see right here and then the truck once again i'm not going to go into too much detail it does look pretty shiny though um i do like the color just not the the chassis and wheel 
options or the tire color options. So now for the final three, we're gonna do Demo Derby here. Demo Derby is probably my favorite truck, Hot Wheels Moss truck wise. So let's take this out of the package and take a look at the orange crushable car. And here is the Demo Derby. Nothing new once again, but I'll give you a little look around of the truck. So now that you've seen that, let's take this car out. And I have no clue what this car could be. Maybe a Monte Carlo or, or something from the 90s. Uh, it's called Speed Bump. Pretty awesome. Once again, looks insane and looks really, really cool. Look at all these crushable cars right here, guys. That looks really, really awesome. We'll take a look at the twin mill first. Here's the Hot Wheels twin mill with the car, the matching car. So let's take it out of the package, take a look at it. So here is the casting. Take a look at the new twin mill. It's in red instead of blue, basically. But I do advise checking your Walmarts and looking for the dump bins that you saw in the beginning of this video at my local Walmart. Because if my local Walmart got it, then I'm pretty sure everyone's did because my Walmart is pretty late on getting stuff. So it's basically hit everywhere now. So I'd be checking your source if you guys want these. Here's the twin mill. This one actually looks really sick. This looks like the uh, the newest version of the twin mill. I'm pretty sure it is. Let's see, it's twin mill three. Yeah, so um, this is actually my first casting of the new twin mill. Um, Hot Wheels car and it looks pretty cool. So here's the new twin mill pretty awesome It does match the truck and it looks insane especially from the back it looks so futuristic So obviously a fantasy car, but still cool to look at it has the blue bead locks on the truck and a blue roll cage so That looks pretty awesome. So now for the final truck We have the orange Roger Dodger with the matching car. Here's the orange Roger Dodger I love Roger Dodger especially like that purple and uh, goldish one that came out um, when Hot Wheels first started making these trucks So um, that one just looks insane and Roger Dodger's just an awesome truck and or a car in general so let's take this out of the package take a look at roger dodger let's take a look at the car for the truck i have a few roger dodger castings of hot wheels cars too if you guys don't know i do collect the cars as well i do like the blue windshield i like how the blue and orange go together and then the black stripes and hot wheels symbol on the side it says 68 for hot wheels 68 the big engine and then the exhaust the side exhaust pipes it looks awesome it looks very muscly definitely takes from a uh an, a 60s 70s muscle car and then here is the matching truck um we have the simple wheels tires um i do like the blue roll cage it goes good with the blue windshield with the orange body and once again, the black stripes on the side. We have the Hot Wheels, basically the same thing. It has the hot, it has the Moss Truck symbol, which the cars do not have the Hot Wheels or Moss Truck. Well, it may have the Hot Wheels symbol, but they do not have the Moss Truck symbol like the, the trucks have. Um, but basically the same. It doesn't have the side exit exhaust pipes like it, we have on the car. See, there's a few little variants, but other than that, uh, it's basically the same. It's the same casting. Just uh, make it, made it a little bigger to fit on the Hot Wheels truck. As you can see, it is a little bigger, but that's for them to fit on the, on the uh, big trucks. So um, there you go guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I only get these two trucks in the frame since these are the only new ones. So those are the crush cars. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, and of course subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.